Hey, YouTubers, this is Bob. Well, it's so good to be back with you guys. Um, anyways, pardon me if I look a little out of it today. I'm really tired. My eyes are kind of puffy. I didn't sleep much. Uh, yesterday, on Saturday, I had to go and film another episode of the new television series that I'm in. Um, and I can't tell you all the details now, but I will in the coming months as we get closer to release, be giving you all of the information on that. So bear with me if I'm a little out of it today. I'm just a little tired because when I got on the set, um, you know, I started around noon filming and we went till about midnight. So it was about 12 hours straight of filming and retakes and edits. It's a lot of work. Any of you have ever worked in television, you know, there's also a lot of time waiting around while they change the lights and stuff. So it's, it's a long day. Um, but it's going well, and I'm excited. So, anyways, I um, actually want to do this video um, as a thank you video because one of my subscribers, uh, and he's also a friend now, his name is Twight Twee. Um His actual name is Joe. He um, had a private reading with me um, a few weeks ago, and um, we had a really great reading, and uh, I enjoyed I was honored he took the time to contact me and set up a private reading. And um, according to Joe, he really enjoyed it. And um, anyways, I received a surprise in the mail this week, which just really, um, was this past week, really just blew me away. Um, and Joe, I want to say thank you. I, I know that uh, we'd spoken briefly, but uh, anyways, I want to do this video to formally thank you and to let everybody know how wonderful you are. Um, I got this wonderful giant box, and I said, what is in this? I didn't even know what this was. And um, didn't even know it was going as an actual, really a surprise. But I opened the box, and uh, the first thing I found, it was a lot of, you know, styrofoam and bubble wrap and all that padding stuff. And I get down in, and I find this thing, and I opened it. And what is it but a hand-painted, beautiful pentagram box done in gold leaf and beautiful aqua. This kind of looks like that kind of Tiffany blue color, which I just, it's one of my favorite colors. This sort of aqua blue green. I'm a big fan of it. Well, I said, oh, Joe must really be psychic too because he knows I collect boxes. Actually, I don't think I ever told him that, but collecting boxes is one of my hobbies. I love little boxes. And I have all sorts, you know, Limoges and Sevrod and crystal boxes and silver boxes. I just like boxes. So, this is beautiful and I, I'm so excited. Well, it gets better because I, oh, oh if that lid comes off, I open the box, and it's inside. It's done in gold leaf, and inside there are, I don't know if you guys can see this, divination dice that Joe handmade. These are um, uh, carved with runic symbols on them, and so you can you know, shake them, roll them, and cast your fortune. You've got pentagrams on them, and mystical signs, and sigils of the runes. So I, you know, I gotta say I love this. This is this is fast. I'm gonna be playing with my runic dice and seeing what my fortune is. So I, Joe, I just want to say thank you. This is this was lovely. Absolutely, you couldn't have done better. Now the amazing thing is, Joe hand makes all of his stuff. This was not bought at a store. He made this for me. He's a true artist. Well, just when I think I'm thrilled beyond words. I notice there's more underneath all the, the bubble wrap. And I pull out the next thing, and this is what I uncovered. It's a handmade witch's broom charm. And um, Joe did this as well by hand, and he put on it uh, good luck charms for me. So we've got some uh, lapis stones here for psychic vision. Um, this looks like a, um, a turquoise for protection. We've got another uh, a snake charm here, a little coiled serpent. Uh, we got a crystal ball. We got amethyst. Uh, we got little, you know, like beads. And then up at the end here, uh, it's got quartz crystals, and you can see a little, um, like a little like antique um, key. I don't know if you guys can see that. But I I love this, and you know, Joe, I can tell you custom made it for me because you put on things that are good luck for a psychic and also a Wiccan, and I love this. I'm going to put uh, these in my office here for good luck, and I, you know, I, I figured even if they don't bring me any luck, they brought me 
a blessing just by coming. But I know that they're very powerful because I feel a lot of energy in them. And I'm very, very blessed by that. And I just want to, I would say thank you, you know. So I think I can't be more amazed. And I dig down in, and there's more paper. And out of the box also comes a mystical book. Look at this. What is this? And I opened it up. And it's a secret hiding box. So it's actually a box to put charms in. And actually, there was a charm in here. Joe had an antique uh, skeleton key for me. Joe, I left that at home on the table, unfortunately, because um, I was packing stuff and I left it sitting out. But I love that, too. I I'm amazed. Now, guys, this is all of these are handmade by Joe. He's an artist. Very talented. He uses gold leaf, hand paints, everything. And this is this is art. You can't go just pick up at you know your local store. And uh, I would like to encourage all of you, if you are interested in handmade spiritual crafts, that you contact Joe. His channel is Twite Twee, and I'll put it up here and also in the box over on the side. And uh, you check it out, because look at all of these. These are wonderful gifts. Oh, also, I forgot there's another thing. There's so much I'm so excited. Um, in the beautiful little box with the dice, Joe also included for me a pendant that he put in. And if you guys can see that, it's a cobra pendant. And I like snakes. I think they're signs of spiritual power. So I'm now wearing my cobra pendant that Joe sent me. Joe, you rock, dude. Thank you. I... I can't even express how excited I am. This is really, really, really nice, and um, I love it. So, guys, check out his stuff. You won't be disappointed. Um, I told Joe, I said, Joe, you know, you're going to have a lot of people, once they realize you make all of this, contacting you. So, guys, you know, contact him, um, and he could probably custom make stuff for you. Um, it is a business that he's starting, and I think it's really worth the money and investing in. And I'm really blessed that he shared his wonderful crafts and art with me. Joe, thank you so very much. This is, this is my, I don't even know words to express. Um, and you know, spirit's funny like that. Because the day when these arrived last week, I was having a really, really, really bad day. It's like I'd had um, some clients steal money from me. I'd had, um, you know, people just giving me grief. It was one of those days, you know, where just even psychics have bad days. Well, when I got home and I got Joe's package, it just, it changed my day. And it changed the rest of my week. Mm -hmm. And, you know, Joe, that was very generous. Totally out of the blue. I had no idea this was coming. And uh, I want to say thank you. Thank you for your friendship. Thank you for your kindness. Um, thank you for your support for my business as well. So I want to support your business. And I want to encourage everybody watching this, contact Joe at his channel, Twite Tweet, and uh, ask him to make you some custom things. He he does everything by hand, and he could probably, if you had an idea of something you want, I bet you he could do it for you. So um, anyways, Joe, thank you so much. Blessings to you. Guys, thanks for being here. Uh, thanks for putting up with my tired look. And um, I will be bringing you more stuff about my TV show um, as we get closer. In the meantime, don't forget, uh, for those of you who haven't seen, I have two books published. Uh, when Worlds Unite, which I did with Thomas Allen Berg, who's uh, Bergland1944 is his channel. And also Ouija Mysteries, which is my latest book about my work as a psychic with the Ouija board. So... Check those out as well. So there's a lot there to keep you guys busy between Joe's crafts and my books. And uh, we'll see if we bring you another messages from the sphere world as well, guys. Thanks for being here. Blessings to all of you.